also work with the nonprofit Athletes for Care. Can you kind of talk about how um, you got involved with them and um, what you do with Athletes for Care? Yeah, so Athletes for Care really helped me when I thought that I was, um, I was really kind of in a low place. Um, I had decided to like hang up my racket, so to speak. I had retired after um, playing professional wheelchair tennis on the tour for almost 20 years. And um, after the Paralympics in Rio in 2016, I, um, I decided that I was tired of taking these seven medications that I've been taking for my whole entire life. And I was just ready to try something new. And so I decided that I was gonna get my medical marijuana card here in, in the state of Arizona. And I kid you, I kid you not to this day, which is really exciting. I don't feel tired anymore. The medical marijuana is able to do what those seven medications did for me, but gave me horrible side effects. So I reached out to Athletes for Care through a Google search, purely, just purely luck. Um, I was looking for a doctor or someone that could write a TUE for me, which is a therapeutic use exemption form, um, so that I could go back because I decided that I wanted to compete in another sport called paracanoe. And I was like, I am not going to compete again under these circumstances. I was just miserable. And even you can look at pictures of me where I just was more bloated, like I just had more inflammation and I, marijuana really, like the CBD really changed like the way my body felt and how how good it, like I just, I didn't wake up tired and feeling crappy. 